happening today, the Muskogee Creek Nation Light Horse Police are getting ready to head to South Dakota and help flood victims at one of the hardest hit Indian reservations in the Midwest. Two works for your reporter Jitzel Puente is live from Okmulgee with how preps are going this morning. Jitzel. Well, Corey Aaron, the police chief here at the Light Horse Police, tells me that they're ready to go. They're making that 13 hour drive to South Dakota. They just need to load up a few donations that they received last minute yesterday, but they have their trucks and their trailers ready to make that 13 hour drive. Now we do have video from the Pine Ridge Reservation, which was one of the hardest hit areas there in South Dakota after two weeks of flooding. These images were provided by the NBC station in Rapid City. Several organizations like the Red Cross have been helping the reservation through donations to help thousands of families affected. Many of them were displaced. Now here in Oklahoma, people have also donated supplies to help the tribe. We were here last week in Okmulgee when these items started pouring in at the Muskogee Creek Nation's Light Horse Police. The chief says they have a trailer full of basic necessities to distribute up north. Now a team of eight tribal members are ready to stay there for a few days, but they're prepared to stay even longer depending on the help that is needed. Reporting in Okmulgee, Jitzel Puente, two works for you.